Community Matters in Shreveport's Columbia Park has a makeover. NBC 6's Miriam Samake joins me in studio sharing more on this. Miriam? Hi Dan, Columbia Park is now a little more accessible and it's thanks to a program director who wants to have fun like everyone else. So what it says to me is we don't want you here. You're not important to the community. We don't really care that you can come out and participate. Three months ago, an employee at New Horizons, a nonprofit independent living organization, came to Columbia Park to do outreach. She was forced to go home because the park was not accessible. She said it wasn't accommodating. There weren't even any reasonable accommodations. I couldn't get in the bathroom. I couldn't find a place to park. And I said, well, you know what? We're going to have to do something about that. Idens did an ADA survey of the park, looking at the pathways, parking lots, and bathrooms. He then spoke with the ADA coordinator for Shreveport and SPAR. It's unsafe because it's too steep. The pitch of it is, is, is too difficult for somebody like me in a wheelchair to go down as safely. ADA coordinator Alonzo Smith said in a letter, the issues that could be resolved immediately have been corrected. This includes signs for designated handicap parking, ADA approved accessible ramps, and less grass and trip hazards on pathways. That says to me that you are welcome. That says to me that we do want you here. You're a part of our community and we welcome you and we want you to be out, come out and have a good time just like everybody else. Now there are still some issues like making the bathrooms accessible and having access to the gazebo in the park. In the letter, ADA coordinator Alonzo Smith said that they intend to aggress address these needs in future bond proposals. Dan? Glad to see it's being taken care of. Miriam, thanks so much for that.